Well, when I moved out here in sixth grade, I noticed that there was a lot of kids that did club swim. And back in Florissant, there was like one club team, but like I had never thought about doing it. So when I moved out here, it was just a new thing to do. And I ended up really liking it. So then I stuck with it. I do the 500 free, which a lot of people don't like because it's very long. And I usually do, I do fly a lot too, which again, people don't like. And then probably like 200 free too. I've basically done all of them. Our coaches put us in our best events so that we can get the most points. So the 500 free, it's 20 laps. It's long enough to reach of a counter because you forget what lap you're on. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's freshman year, my coach noticed that I did really well in the 200 free. And he's like, you still have a lot more energy in you. So we're gonna put you in the 500 free next meet. And I was like, oh God. And so I did it. Funny story on the first 500 I ever did my counters miscounted for me. So I actually finished a 50 early, but I was gonna win either way, but then I just won and then got disqualified. I like the team, the team's definitely good, people to be around. And then I just personally like pushing myself. I would say swim is the hardest sport I do. I have been captain since sophomore year. Um, so I've been a leader for quite a bit, but senior year, all seniors usually step up senior year. So I like having me and the other seniors try to help the freshmen and newcomers as much as we can. During the first like couple weeks of practice, my lane will like go over and help like the freshmen and the newcomers. A lot of them haven't swam before and the rest of us have been swimming for at least four years. I'm usually picky about what I eat on meet days. I do this with every single sport and it's always like peanut butter, honey, and banana. It's like my lunch that day. And then we all like meet down in the lobby um, before the meet, it's like to talk to the girls get excited for the races we're doing, even if they're not races that we like to do. We still try to get people hyped up. And then during the meet itself, we always have, we're always standing at the end of the lanes cheering each other on, which I think is great. Um, I definitely think that gets us in the mood for swimming to make us go fast. <laughs> St. Charles, whenever we race against the St. Charles schools, we just swim with the Y and we take bets every year on what the temperature of the water is gonna be because it's always insanely hot. You just probably think water is like cool, but imagine like running or doing your sport outside in 90 degrees, but like instead we have to swim in 90 degrees and it's like you're completely covered in it. I was kind of thinking about like most colleges have like the club teams, which like are just like more fun. And like you still compete, but it's not like you're recruited for it. Um, I was thinking about doing like the triathlon teams in college because then I could still swim, bike, and run, which are three of the things I highly enjoy. And even if I don't do that, I'll probably still swim to get like a workout in.